Today, I'm announcing uh, several critical actions that my administration is taking to confront a problem that we have right here at home. We fight wars that are 6,000 miles away, wars that we should have never been in in many cases, but we don't control our own border. So we're going to confront the national security crisis on our southern border, and we're going to do it one way or the other. We have to do it. And when you listen to politicians, uh, in particular certain Democrats, they say it all comes through the port of entry. It's wrong. It's wrong. It's just a lie. It's all a lie. They say walls don't work. Walls work 100 percent. Everybody knows that. Nancy knows it. Chuck knows it. They all know it. It's all a big lie. It's a big con game. So I'm going to be signing a national emergency. And it's been signed many times before. It's been signed by other presidents. From 1977 or so, it gave the presidents the power. There's rarely been a problem. They sign it. Nobody cares. I guess they weren't very exciting. But nobody cares. They sign it for far less important things in some cases, in many cases. We're talking about an invasion of our country with drugs, with human traffickers, with all types of criminals and gangs. We have some of the greatest people I know. They've been with me from the beginning of my campaign, almost from the first week, the angel moms. Unfortunately, we have new angel moms. One incredible woman just showed me her daughter, who we're talking about killed in the year of 18. I said, I haven't seen you before. She said, no, I'm new. I said, that's too bad. It's too bad.